Okay, so at this point, our next step would be to take another charm rack and to install it into this space that's been opened up by the vacated Provox turn panel. As you'll notice, the total height of the charm rack plus the panduit will fit into this spot to facilitate that installation. At that point, we'll take the next 16 I.O. and we'll spread it across both the charm rack that's already in it, the last eight locations, plus the last eight locations of the next charm carrier up that we would install. By moving these 16 across these two charm carriers would allow us to then remove this panel and to take the next 16 and the wire them to the first 16 of this charm carrier. Once those 16 are moved, then these two panels will come out and now there is more space available and for our next charm rack to go into place. As this process moves up the cabinet, we're going to end up with space at the top of the cabinet that will then facilitate the installation of our CIOCs, which will be the communications cards for the individual charm racks.